flow. Okay. So, fine. Amanda! Where the hell are we? And why is Amanda here? Questions for later. Let's see. Can I just walk anywhere? Oh, evidently not. Okay. I'm gonna walk on this guy. I can't walk on the grass. Birds! Pretty. What about, can I walk on the stone paths? Ooh, I sure can. Scan. Something over there. God, this place is kind of beautiful. Pidget! What is this thing? It's like Stargate. Well, I wonder what that did. <laughs> More birds. Bird. My bird arrow. Bird. <laughs> la la la. So be a bird! Birds! <laughs> oh, you just scare those birds all day. La la la, just one of a bird guy! Alright, I think I've scared off every bird. <laughs> I can rest easy now. Whoa! No, there's more birds! Hmm. Alright, I think uh, Amanda's the only thing that's really here. Yeah. Ah, birds! Rats with wings! Ah, what's up, girl? Hello, Amanda. Connor, it's good to see you. Damn straight. Congratulations, Connor. Finding that deviant was far from easy. Uh huh. And the way you interrogated it was very clever. Oh yeah, it was. You've been remarkably efficient, Connor. Well, thank you. Don't toot my own horn, but we've uh, asked the DPD to transfer it to us for further study. It may teach us something about what happened. The interrogation seemed challenging. Mm. What did you think of the deviant? Uh, he was traumatized. Showed the signs of PTSD after being abused by its owner, as if its original program had been completely replaced by new instructions. This Lieutenant Anderson has been officially assigned to the deviancy case. Okay. What do you make of him? There's my bro. Yeah, I think he's irritable and socially challenged. But I also think he used to be a good detective. He's an intriguing character. Unfortunately, we have no choice but to work with him. What do you think is the best approach? Adapt. I will adapt to his personality. It is in the best interest of the investigation that I avoid conflict and try to accommodate his psychology. More and more androids show signs of deviancy. Mm -hmm. There are millions in circulation. If they become unstable, the consequences will be disastrous. You're well, the most advanced prototype Cyberlife has ever created. Well, of course if I am. If anyone can figure out what's happening, it's you. You can count on me, Amanda. Yes, and whoever you are. And I only know you your name pretty much at this point. Hurry, Connor. There's little time. 
For what? What are you talking about? Why is everyone being so vague and cryptic with me? Alright. Go to reception. Should we walk around first? Uh, wants me to talk to her. Let's see what's going on. Waiting area here. You might be in shock. Just, just take it easy. Yeah. Would you mind getting me some water, please? Tensions sure. in the Arctic have reached Ooh, a new level. TV? A Russian carrier and an American patrol boat reported to have clashed last night. <laughs> Several warning shots were exchanged. Looks like uh, no not much has changed in the future. The Minister for Defense, Dennis Riggs, has spoken of intolerable provocation that cannot go unanswered. The countries in the region, particularly Sweden and Canada, have called for military forces to withdraw and an international conference to be held. Get out of Canada, eh? All right, let's see what uh, is going on at the desk here. Hello. Can I help you? I'm here to see Lieutenant Anderson. Yeah, and get your phone number. Yes. Uh, oh, we are connecting, aren't we? Soulmates. Lieutenant Anderson hasn't arrived yet, but you can wait at his desk. What if I don't want to wait at his desk? Alright, well. Alright, let's go to the desk. Oh. Crash right into that guy. My cameraman did. Do, 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 do. Ooh. Wow, there's all kinds of crap in here. Oh, damn, that's cool. Yep, they're like, uh, guys, we haven't, uh, Arrested enough minorities. I mean, what are, what are we doing wrong here? I mean, come on. We're the cops here. They expect a certain level of uh, uh, of intolerability from us. All right, let's get out of here while they're going to their sensitivity training. Do, 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 do. Whose desk is this? Person. <laughs> you know what? I think I was able to talk to this. Yeah, I was able to talk to her when I walked by. I'm looking for Lieutenant Anderson's desk. It's that desk right there. Okay. We shall go to that desk then. Short oh. Delhi. A lot of parenting, what? Hmm, that's crazy. Uh, I don't have time to read all this right now, but we'll come back to that. Da! Done found it! Excuse me. Do you know what time Lieutenant Anderson usually arrives? Depends on where he was the night before. If we're lucky, we'll see him before noon. Thanks. Sounds like he's got a pretty awesome schedule. Yeah, let's sit down. Chair look comfortable. <laughs> Just gonna sit here. Explore the office, huh? Go see the deviant. Hmm. Wait, 
What do we got here? Oh, let's play. Whoa! Knights of the Black Death? They sound charming. Super, super classy. Call? Who am I going to call? Call Hank Anderson. Hi, this is Hank. Not here at the moment. You can leave a message if that's what turns you on, but don't expect me to call back. <laughs> Beep. Beep. <laughs> uh, let's leave a message. Lieutenant Anderson, this is Connor. I'm the android sent by Cyberlife. It's almost noon, and I'm waiting for you at the office. <laughs> it's almost noon, for Christ's sakes. Oh, there's a hat. Okay, baseball cap. We don't bleed the same color, anti-android stuff. Okay, well, at least things aren't stacked against us. St. Bernard dog. There's a big dog. What we got there? Oh, remember Jimmy's? We were at Jimmy's bar the other night. Uh-oh, uh, uh. cop food. <laughs> I'm glad we scanned that. I mean, ooh, Japanese maple, pretty. It looks kind of dead though. Oh, I could go for some coffee. Oh, cold coffee. It's it's been there too long. What do we got here? Okay, Detroit police uh, dismantle a network of red ice dealers. Okay. Detective Anderson promoted to the rank of lieutenant. Well, good for him. Uh, new record seizure of red ice in Detroit. All right. Uh, homeboy used to get his work done. What was that? Okay. So we had a task force at one point. All right. Oh, oh shit. It's good to see you again, Lieutenant. Oh, Jesus. Hank! In my office. Yeah, Hank, what he said. Listen in, explore the office. No, I'm exploring the office. I'm not listening. I'm a detective. I'll explain it. I figured it out on my own. What's over here? Break room? Maybe I can get me some coffee. Look at that. Our friend, the plastic detective, is back in town. Congratulations on last night. Very impressive. Yes, it was. Until you try to fuck it all up. Douche. Greet. Hello. My name is Connor. <laughs> Never seen an android like you before. Damn straight. Monarch. The best. Oh. Answer. Might as RK well. 800. I'm a prototype. A prototype? Android detective. So a machine's gonna replace us all. Is Possibly. Hey. Bring me a coffee, dipshit. <laughs> you think I'm gonna get you coffee, douche? Move on! Whoa. Well, since you asked nicely. F you. I gave you an order. I'm sorry, but I only take orders from Lieutenant Anderson. Oh, oh. <laughs> oh, a cheap shot, son of a bitch. If Hank hadn't gotten the way yesterday, I would have fucked you up for disobeying a human. Stay out of my way. Because next time, you won't get off so easy. I hope we bash you all up. Oh, let's get right there. All right, now we need to get up after getting cheap shot in the goddamn gut. Should have poured him a coffee and dumped it on him. Several sources report that Cyberlife has provided Detroit police with a prototype detective android. 
Although police assistant androids have existed for several years now, opinion went down. The case of an android being authorized to play an active role in criminal investigations. Well, we just went through that. Oh, yeah, that's right. Uh, let's go see our buddy. Hey, who's this? What's going on, man? What? Hmm. What are you looking at? Ah, uh, nothing. It's a very nice cell you have here. Hey, fuck you. Oh, okay, well. I can see you're having a bad day, so I'm just going to let you hang out there. <laughs> Jeez. What hospitality? Oh, that's creepy. They're going to destroy me. I won't let them. Uh, sincere, cold, compassionate. Let's be compassionate. He's not happy. I'm sorry. It's not what I wanted. But there's nothing I can do. I know there's something you didn't tell me. I need to know before they take you away. They spilled the beans, damn it. Secret. What you said yesterday. The truth is inside. What does it mean? I'm going to die. No. Oh. Oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> I don't know what else to say. Can I get you out of here? I'll break you out of organs. Jailbreak! Come on, get both of you out of here. Alright, well, I guess I can. It'd be bad on my resume. Oh. Oh. Open the cell, quick! Hurry! No, 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 no! Oh, damn! Call Cyberlife. Clean this mess up. What did I do? Damn! He's busted now. Can I get inside? He wrote something on the walls there. Oh, that was terrible. Oh, there's nothing I can do about it now. Yeah, let's go this way. Why not? What is this? Evidence room? Oh. I guess I'm not authorized. Oh. La dee da. Oh. He's not in there anymore. Understanding constructive. Oh, that's too it's an honor to be working with you, Lieutenant. I'm sure we'll make a great team. Do partners, yeah? Now that we're partners, it would be great to get to know each other better. Okay. Not in a, uh, a, a talkative move. Uh, let's just ask for the desk. He doesn't want to talk. Is there a desk 
Anywhere I could use? No one's using that one. Okay. Ah. Snazzy desk. Oh. Music, dog, baseball. Let's do music. Do you listen to Knights of the Black Death? I really like that music. It's <laughs> full of energy. Uh, yeah, that's you a way of putting it. Heavy metal? Well, I don't really listen to music as such, but I'd like to. Yeah, I like to listen to music like Bon Iver when I'm trying to uh, shut myself off. Uh, he seemed to enjoy that. Let's talk about, everyone loves talking about their dog. You have a dog, right? How do you know that? The dog hair's on your chair. I like dogs. What's your dog's name? What's it to you? <laughs> just... Sumo. Nah. I call him Sumo. Hey, it's a Sumo dog. <laughs> Okay, hour, hours, uh, let's do, I guess let's talk about, I don't want to talk about anti-androids, because that's, let's talk about baseball. You're a Detroit Gears fan, right? Denton Carter scored 53% of his shots from the three-point line yesterday. Did you see the game? That's what I was watching at the bar last night. Oh, that's right. I didn't, uh, that was, uh, yeah. Stupid, uh, duh. Let's just start working, because I, <laughs> I feel like he's mad now. Okay. If you have any files on deviance, I'd like to take a look at them. Terminal's on your desk. Knock yourself out. Uh, let's do this. Oh, that's an interesting way to use a keyboard. Missing. Uh, plaintiff reports that he left his Android at home. As usual, when he went to work and returned, Android was nowhere to be found. No trace of a break-in of the apartment. Android may have left the home without being told. Oh. So, the suspect. He said it's open. Plaintiff claims to have been attacked by the whatever model. Android working as a waiter in the Fast Coney Dogs restaurant chain. Okay, on the avenue there. Plaintiff claims Android lunged at him unexpectedly and attempted to strangle the man. Before leaving the scene, Android remains at large. Oh, shit. Suspect. Plaintiff claims to have been attacked by her Android, whatever model. Android also trashed several rooms in the house before taking flight. Well, Android's like, well, fuck you, because that's why I'm destroying these two rooms. Huh. Hey, sex Android. Well, well let's get on this case right here. The Android disappeared after accompanying a customer to his home and never returned to the club. Well, I, you don't quite need to be a detective to figure that one out, but, uh, okay, let's go on. Destroyed. Yo, man. Was found. Conscious. His father, Carl, I found the witness to assist between his son and the house android. The android is thought to be a prototype unknown model and series number was destroyed at the scene by the officer. Damn, that's what happened to Marcus. Damn, cops did the only thing they know how to do is just start shooting and beating things up. Damn. <gasps> what? Kara. The victim body was found by a friend who came by to say hello. He immediately called the emergency service at blah, blah, blah. Who recorded death by gunshot wound. The murder weapon may have been 
belonged to the victim. His android, blah, 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 was not found on the scene and is the main suspect. What? Oh, shit. He, so he died. I thought he got shot in the shoulder, but he's dead. 243 files. Whoa, First that's a bunch. Back nine months. It all started in Detroit and quickly spread across the country. An AX-400 is reported to have murdered a man last night. That could be a good starting point. That's not how it went down. Oh, what? What's wrong, man? I thought we were buddies. Direct, aggressive, professional, understanding. Let's be direct. You shouldn't let your personal situation hamper the investigation, Lieutenant. You don't know what the hell you're talking about. So why don't you just run your program and shut the fuck up? Whoa, okay, well, let's that be that, uh... I suggest you sort out your personal issues oh, and let me work with someone more competent. Whoa! <laughs> an asshole. If it was up to me, I'd throw the lot of you in a dumpster and set a match to it. So stop pissing me off. But things are gonna get nasty. Hey, man. Hello, Lieutenant? We're cool, okay? I'm sorry to disturb you. Get your hands off me. I have some information on the AX-400 that killed the guy last night. It's been sighted in the Ravendale district. I'm on it. Shit. Well, I... <laughs> We're supposed to be friends, man! What the hell? Okay, well... That didn't go as smoothly as I thought it would, but that's alright. We'll continue on anyway.